Good evening, everyone, and welcome to This Day Night Arkham, this week brought to you on a Wednesday. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm Sean, and joining me is my fellow Mythos Buster, Scott. Hola. As you well might expect. I, like, if you're watching this and you, and you don't know, then I, I guess there's been a grievous error in sequence, and I advise you rectify it. Um, but tonight, we are continuing our Skids and Daisy campaign. Uh, if you haven't checked out last week's play, we did Return to Midnight Mass, and it was a pretty good run. I'm, you know, I'm proud of it, considering mm -hmm. how the rest of this campaign has gone. Mm -hmm. uh, and it got us enough XP to get on through to the rest of our side stories that we wanted to get to. So tonight is the Eternal Slumber. So Scott, you weren't mm -hmm. there... But the first time I played Eternal Slumber, I uh, I had a bit of a salty experience. This may surprise you. Uh, this was at Gen Con. This was at Gen Con. The year okay. that it, you know, the 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 event where it first came out. Mm -hmm. I have some very specific feelings about this scenario, but uh, in a campaign, as a side story, into player, I find it to be pretty reasonable. If you know, still still hard. Yes. We could very well get our socks rocked off tonight, but yeah. um, I am looking forward to it. It is a fun scenario. Yeah, I uh, I have not... Pl have I played this standalone? Oh, no, I have, yeah. Yeah. I think we did it at Arkham Knights that year, we? Didn't we did. You know, I don't think I've played it since the Arkham Knights when this came out with the other part of Guardians. Okay. So... Wow. All right. Yeah. Honestly, if you're gonna sit, if I feel like a long game of Arkham, if I feel like an involved game of Arkham, this would probably be at the top of the list to play because this is almost like a little campaign. It's it's a scenario in three acts. Yeah, it is. Um, so that being said, let's maybe get this started because we're gonna be streaming a long time tonight. Uh, yeah. Uh, let me just click on the correct buttons here. Oh boy. Uh, what Sean, did what did you change in your deck? Because um, so we, we had 6 XP. Of... Let's, let, from... Yeah. Yeah, yeah so. so we had 60, 6 XP from last time, and in the interest of making sure we still have enough experience to buy um, Guardians of the... No, not Guardians of the, the Abyss. What's the second one? Uh, Eternal Slumber and... Uh, uh, one sec. I'll, I will find it in the actual TTS. Knights Usurper. Podcast about them. The Knights Usurper, thank you. Yeah. Um, so in, in the interest of making sure we have enough to buy the Knights Usurper and the Blob, uh, I'm only spending 2 XP and I'm just upgrading one of my Wards of Protection to level 2. So, pretty vanilla. But hopefully important. Yeah, I, um, I spent 0 XP. And the reason <laughs> being is I have cards in my deck that... Uh, reduce the amount of XP that I get. So I currently have enough. I, I paid two for this, so I have four left. So basically from here out, on out, I'm not paying for a side scenario. But anything I get, I can use, was my logic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, so what I adaptabled is I took out two lone wolves because I think we're going to be sticking moderately close together. Yep. Um, and I took out two fine clothes because there's not a whole lot of parlay, as far as I remember. Is there? A little bit with the cultists, but not not heavily. Yeah. And I put in two, I'm out of here. Uh, so if we get bogged down with monsters, I can engage a bunch, let you run, and then just get out of there. We're not sabotaging cool. the train. Um, <laughs> just saying that. Um, and then you handle this one. I put in two copies. So I took out two lone wolves, two fine clothes. I put in two you handle this one and two I'm out of here. The reason being is there are some treacheries in here that are just absolutely devastating to skids. Just be like two willpower is just terrible. Um, I kept my two say your prayers in because. Yep. Yeah. You'll we'll probably get to a point where you can use them in this I'm, scenario. I'm two horror away already because of my trauma. <laughs> so what's your trauma at? Uh. You have trauma? Uh, I think I'm just a mental, which I had not put down yet. Okay, that's what I thought. All right, well. All right. Shuffle get... up and deal. Did you promote me yet? Uh, I sure haven't. But you know what? You've okay. you've done a good enough job. I'm gonna I'm gonna send you right to the top. Yay! Okay, so I've got studious. So let's see six cards here. Ooh. 
That's not the worst. Oh my! Starting hand I could hope for. Oh my! Um, so I want to keep Pantalone. Yes. Keep Mind Over Matter, and I want to keep Saint Hubert's Key for sure. I think you I keep Lagrasse. I think. It... <sighs> and I think you chuck Inquiring Mind and Shortcut. Oh, Lagrasse is a. I mean, he's basically mm -hmm. a, a Inquiring Mind. Almost. Yeah. I think I want to chuck Legrasse and shortcut for now. Just just because I want to see a couple more options for setting up. I'd say chuck inquiring mind sure. for sure. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's fair. I'd say okay, just yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right. Well, I mean, okay. It's fine, <laughs> I guess. Uh, no, 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 that makes sense. Yeah. There you go. All right. Not going to complain about that. That's pretty solid. What's your plan for open gates? Uh, I feel like I just put one somewhere in Cairo, and then that'll help us later on when we need to zip back. Mm -hmm. Where I put it in Cairo is kind of up for debate. Probably in the streets, just because it's so central. I'd say that, yeah. Um, or, uh, yeah, streets are... Like, part of me says almost outskirts, and that is your version of I'm out of here. So when you have a second one, like... You take an act like you, you can play it fast and then take an act of act uh, attack of opportunity to move and then you can resign if need be. Boy, that sounds like you're planning to lose, Scott. I'm not planning to lose. I just know that <laughs> there's a lot of things in here that could make us lose. And what if us one of us gets sucked into the abyss? It's a real possibility, Oof. Sean. Yeah, we'll deal with that. I've I've seen it happen. Um, that might just be solo Daisy, me looking over your shoulder. And then you bring skids back from the death. Wouldn't that be a great show? <laughs> right. Let's see what I got here. Get rid of Boy, us. those hospital deaths really, really persistent. This uh, this campaign. Ooh, mm -hmm. hey, Ace of Swords. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Thanks, Nick. How many weaknesses are you up to? Four? I'm at four weaknesses. Yeah. In my God, how much XP do I have? 14 experience tech. <laughs> so I'm going to be ballsy. I'm going to chuck this. That seems fine I've, for an opener. Yeah, I have two copies. Um, I want to keep this. Mm -hmm. I want to keep this. Sure. I want to keep this. Together. I think so. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Bow, bow. Okay, so go into the uh let's go up here to the scoreboard. Uh so seven doom uh action investigators may spend two clues as a group, randomly spawn one of the enemies beneath the scenario reference card. They're down here somewhere. Uh on the act, we have force after brotherhood enemy enters the victory display, flip it over and resolve the text on its other side. And then objective, find as many evidence cards as you can. Add them to the victory display before the agenda advances. If there are six advanced, that's not, that is not going to happen. <laughs> no. No. Dude, uh, I've never seen, like, more than three. Yeah, like, if we hit three, I'm really happy. I mean, um, each cultist is a two-part process. It's, yeah. Uh, it's a lot. Mm -hmm. um, our abyss starts at two. Uh, skulls are two, or the equal to the abyss. Uh, cultists, which we have one of, is reveal another token. If you fail and the strength of the abyss is three or lower, add one strength. Tablet is zero for this skill test. Ignore all bonuses. We do not have an elder thing. So awesome. Oh, I do love Knight of the Zealot for that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, there are a couple peril cards in this encounter deck. Should we discuss them super quickly? Sure. Why not? Just because... Uh, they can do things. Let me find them here. God, I don't remember what the peril cards are. The terror of the ah. is in peril. Uh, eclipses at other worlds. We won't be visiting other world in this one. No, nope. be... that'll be for next time. What's the one that goes into the victory display? That oh, the black, oh, the wind. black wind. Okay, 
Let me just pull this out so I can yeah. make it look good. So the Black Wind, I'll make this nice and big for everyone. It is victory. Um, but either choose add one strength to the Abyss and add Black Wind to the victory display, or discard it and draw the top card of the encounter deck. You get minus one to all skills for the remainder of this round. I'm tempted to just victory point them right away. Because there's more I, than I'm one. I'm generally with you. Yeah. I think if it's a turn where... Like, the majority of our turn is going to be moving and not not really any testing. And right. this is maybe, like, the second card we draw. Mm -hmm. Then it could be a good call to, to just eat it. Of course, it gains Surge, doesn't it? It does, yeah. yeah. Like, you get minus one for everything, and then you still draw an encounter deck. Yeah. So I'd say as long as our Abyss isn't, like, five... Mm -hmm. Of course, if it's five, like, why not just lean in, right? Yeah, like, at that point, who cares? It's a victory point, and we're <laughs> probably going to be, like, ending soon. So. Yeah. Um, and what do you think are the cancelable cards? Cancelable? I think that one that's, like, by the amount you fail. Uh, what is it? Abyssal Reach. Test Willpower X. X is Strength of the Abyss. If you fail by one, place it, drop a clue. Two, Damage and Horror. Three can't play cards for I think, ancient evils. I think that one's dependent on the current abyss level because if it gets into those higher areas, then that could be very cancelable. Yeah, I'm worried about Terra under the pyramids, which is test three yeah, willpower. For each point, you discard a card from your hand. Uh, for each, you cannot is horror. But I mean, yeah. Um, I was looking over these, and it was just like, God, this is this is a rough scenario. But we have a plus one, so. And the Knight of the Zealot standard chaos bag, so... Yeah. So, we're a bit okay. Yeah, well, God help us anyway. Here we go. All right. Oh, <laughs> Lita must be busy checking her frequent flyer rewards at the moment. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> She's like, Egypt? Nah. I heard that's tough. She would not be wrong. Apparently Nate got his Abyss up to 12. Yeah. I mean, Jim would be really good in this. Yeah. 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 Oh, he, uh... He is. I can confirm. When the game begins. Is that my Tarot card? Yeah, you do. Hmm. Nice. Uh, do you want to go first? Uh... Sure. Uh, I guess, what's our strategy here? Where should I go? I, I'm not really good at clues. There is one so, with one, one shroud, I believe. I guess, to my mind, it mm, there, there are certain, like, okay, so every cultist has an extra thing you have to do to, like, really finish it. Yes. Um, to my mind, there are not many of the extra things that are worth doing until we know we have that cultist already. Mm -hmm. So I'd say just build up, see if maybe you can get one clue somewhere. Like, okay, uh, sure. So I think my first action is an obvious beat cop. As opposed to the subtle beat cop. Mm hmm. Oh, he's level two, so. Yeah, right. And I believe Museum has Low Shroud. Let's meander over there. That sounds right, but it punishes you for not succeeding by. X oh. Which is, you know. As long as you do it on your last action, you're fine. Oh, okay. Which I will do. Mm -hmm. So, uh. Let's see. That is. One shroud. Uh, I'm a three. Let's do this. All right. Nice. Louver skids. Getting in there. Get it, boy. I need a garbage can on the mat. Clues. <laughs> this is this new clue counter. Anyways. Uh huh. I'm still not sure whether I like it or not, because it is nice to just click it up and down, but like you still have to deal with the clues on the board, so it doesn't actually save you much work. Yeah, I think I don't, is my yeah. 
final. Because when we're streaming, I can grab the clue and then shift over to the mat and just mm-hmm. drop it. But anyways, mm-hmm. why don't you take your turn? All right. Uh, oh, I didn't do this. Oh, yeah. I'm a simple man, and I can't keep track of how many actions I've taken. All right. First action, we'll play down St. Hubert's Key. What a card. Second action, I'll investigate. Uh, three up. That's the clue. And this is the location where I have discovered yeah, two or more him. take a horror. Yep. Right. Which... I think I'm just going to get down Pantalone. And, I was going to uh, say, that's a, yeah. a good safety net. Mm-hmm. I feel like Pantalone right, is going to be... Oh yeah, sorry, go ahead. No, I was just going to say, I always forget that after you play it, yeah. it does something for you. So, Woo! there we go. Ooh, another open gate. You know what's funny is, I guess we were chatting after our last game. Um, and the Ruguru, or sorry, after the Ruguru, and I thought of the perfect line to play. And I was just so... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I sent you a message like 15 minutes later. I was like, ah! I play yeah. down Bauta. That gives me two resources. I pay for another action. I investigate at like four up twice using this method. And then like it was just... Oh. You had the solution. It's just... I had the firing it's, solution. It's a thing. Mm-hmm. It's a thing to think of it in the right moment. It is. Uh, okay. Anyways, enough dreaming of the past. Yeah, I know. We could have werewolf skids right now. Oh, my God. Damn it. Yeah. All right. Uh... Refresh. Mm-hmm. Hallowed mirror. Nice. That's coming out real fast. Yep. What'd you get? Shortcut. I'm just readjusting my camera here. There we go. All, All right. All right. One doom of seven. Am I lead or are you lead? Uh. I don't think it matters. I've got the ward, so you're lead, right? Yes, that's the, the logic. Mm. <laughs> peril, peril, peril. Peril, peril, peril. Well. Mm, I feel like we're off to a good start. Peril, peril. Draw another. Um, you know, one option is I could tell you what I think, and then oh, non-peril. Darn it! I was like, I could I could say what I'm thinking, and then play you handle this one. <laughs> Honestly, man, I'm gonna go to the victory display. Sure. Is that what you've would you have chosen? Uh, I don't think it's a wrong. De- I don't think either of them were wrong decisions. At this yeah. Picture. So I'll just increase. My, my abyss. Your abyss. Abyss me down in the oh. Cairo street. Oh my god. And this one I has had a little bit more time today. I would have had my own intro for everyone. And this one has Dark Sacrifice too, doesn't it? <laughs> yes, it does. Oh my god. And I completely forgot about it. So I am everyone sorry, that. everyone who is. Also, I'm sorry for why my computer's just. Being weird. All right, nice. my card. A swarm of locusts. Ooh. Okay. Well. Well, you have. I a... will probably be using a deny existence on this one. Perhaps. I am one down. Minus three. Okay. Um. So I failed by three. So let's see here. So, so I'm just trying to think mechanically. If I want to deny existence, I have to lose the resource first, right? Because I can only ignore taking yes. damage and their separate effects. Yes. Okay. So I lose the resource, and then I would deny existence the two damage. Mm-hmm. Gross. Yeah. All right. Check on our board here. I got the museum. You got the streets. 
And we need how many clues? We need two clues to spawn a cultist. So we're there. Yeah. Um, do you want me to go first? Shall because, I? Well, I'm... No, let me go first. Because if, like, if Assassin Dude spawns on me, then you can hop in. Okay. That's the only one I'm really worried about. Okay. So I think the way we'll do this, because these, these brotherhoods are two-sided... Um, oh, hey, Matt. Oh, is Matt in the chat? Thanks. Probably won't help, but appreciate the gesture. <laughs> uh, good luck. Yeah, Godspeed. Uh, so R is short for shuffle, right? Yes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press, er, press R three times. And then whoever's on top, that's who gets spawned. Sure. Sure. I'll click your clue down. Hey, look at that. Streets of Cairo. Oh, it's Assassin Boy. Damn it. Okay. So, I mean, do I mind over matter and start to chip away at him? Um. I could also just shortcut myself to you and save you moving to me. Both? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I suppose that wasn't an either or. That was a. Yeah. That was a false choice. Yes, is the answer to that, um, I think. Okay. So, that said, I will play shortcut and fast move down here. Yeah, I think... Oh, I, I can't play Mind Over Matter. Why? I have a no resource. <sighs> Oof. So that said, I might Pantalone to evade... Well, here's the... You, you could it? shortcut and take one and one to gain the resource. Like, I'm pretty sure I can kill him, I think. I'll be three up on three tests. Yeah, but then I... Yeah, sure. Okay. Oh, no, wait. I don't have... Oh, God. I don't have the thing where I... Slip things out of my hand. Uh, maybe try to evade him. Okay. Well, well, uh, you mean just honestly? Because I can't, there's like no way I'll succeed that test. Two up? Oh, I mean with Pantalone. Oh yeah, with Pantalone. Okay. <laughs> so we'll discard that and turn this into an intellect test. Um, oh boy, I can't, I'm not going to chuck my ward, so yeah, two up. Here comes the skull. No! Ah! Alright. Um, boy, this is going well. Mm-hmm. One out of six chance at the one cultist that was going to fuck up my day. Uh, mm. I would not just try mm. it. Bare boat. Oh no, there's no reason to. Um, there's no reason to, so I think I'll just pass. Okay. I'll just pass on my action. Um, hmm. God. So I move in, engage him, and then gain a resource. And play narrow escape to then evade him. So the next round I can play my 45. Okay. I think that's the play. I mean, the upside of this dude is there's no second piece to him. Once we defeat him, like, it's a full cultist. So yeah. All right. Oh, you are with me. Oh, that makes things easier, actually. Yeah, I shortcut it. There was that. There was that little gleaming... You know, mm. silver lining. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm. so gain a resource. Engage him. Gain a resource. No, I have to... Okay, one sec. Go back down to two. So, I engage him. Gain a resource, which narrow escape. Gives me plus two. I mean, I guess I could have just committed... Narrow escape. Uh, two up. Yeah, but you did it stylishly. Nice. Nice. He's evaded. 
you could beat cop him once this turn and once next turn, and that's one last shot you have to take. Yeah, I think I will do that. Mm -hmm. I gotta change my rotation here, because who, who goes 45 degrees? People who are placing location markers. Hmm, I guess so. Okay. Uh, enemy right, phase. Well. <laughs> Eno attack. Lovely. Oh, there's my sleight of hand. Perfect, actually. Nice. Nice. Yeah, this is actually real perfect for it. Yeah. Um, then you can buy an extra action if you need to just unload. Mm hmm. And you got a lab assistant. All right. Two doom of seven. Hmm. Well, I think I might ward that for you. I think we I think have to, unless... This is wardable, because if you fail by three, you are straight boned. Um, yeah. Uh, do we want to ward this, or you handle this? Probably ward? Question mark? Oh, um... Good question. So I'd be one up on the test. Because I feel like we want to ward when the abyss is really high. Yeah, go ahead and... I, I can handle that. That's fine. I mean, yeah. I don't know if I can handle it. Are you going to be playing time. cards this turn? I had nothing key to play. Okay. So Unless, I will... of course, I really wanted to play my ward against whatever I get, but we'll see. Right. You are. And I always forget this, but I actually gain a resource from that. Oh, nice. Ooh. Glad, glad you got something out of it. Mm -hmm. um, it's very roguey. It is, yeah. Do I commit my St. Hubert's key is what I'm debating right now. I don't know if it's worth it. I feel like why not? Well, because what's the worst thing that can happen? You fail by exactly two. That's the thing is like the exactly two is the one I want to avoid. So what are You're the odds one up? Of exactly two. One up minus so three. I have to draw minus two. No, I have to draw minus three. Uh, skulls are minus three. The skulls. Yeah, Damn. commit your St. Hubert's key. Yeah, all right, so I'm five, so two up. Okay, cool. All right. So I pull out my gun. <laughs> Hang on. Oh. Oh, yeah, you got to do Terra. Ooh. Um, dude, I really don't want to kill that. Uh, but it's super not worth a ward, and it's not random card. It is so true as discard, yeah. Yeah, so it's one up. Okay, that's so one card. Fine. So I'm just going to throw this out there. I think maybe an open gate. That's where I was going. Because I think you only need two of them in this scenario. Mm -hmm. Yep, I throw one down here, and then I draw my... I mean, I'm going to draw into my another one. This scenario is... I really think long. you you say you put on outskirts as your out card, okay. personally. Sure, but I'm not opposed to that. Okay. All right, fuck him up. All right, let's do this. So I pulled out my gun. Sleight of hand. Bam. So I'm at three, four, five. Six seven, and he does not have retaliate. Oh my god, so good. Uh, -huh. uh th three up. Ah, aha. Uh -huh. Fuck you, buddy. Three up. Okay. Mm, I'll skip retaliate at least. Three up. Nice. Um, is it worth the beat cop, or is it worth the action? Just pain. Like the ammo doesn't matter. You know, I'm going to beat cop because if I don't, if I do, like, draw the tentacle or something, then I'm hooped. I take, he, he does plus two. He does two and two. Well, no, but, I mean, you always have the option to beat cop after you fail the next test, too. Oh, yeah. Um, so it's just a matter of whether you want the action or not. I, because I have enough resources to actually put out the gun right now and maybe a hollowed mirror. 
But then my beat cop is like near death. I think you just take the next shot. All right. Like, what else are you gonna do with that action? Yeah. Wait, why'd you go down in resources? Well, I admit I. Oh. Right. Oh, sorry. I have another action. Sorry. I thought. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. 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 No. Nope, slight. Shoot. Shoot. Boom. Shoot. Deed. Deed. Victory. Because I failed once, right? Yep. Okay. You missed the second shot. Jeez. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, that's right. We gotta flip him first. So come on up here to the victory. Display. Oh right. Uh, I don't have a thing for that, but I do have this. Blah blah blah. One strength of the abyss. This is what I'm reading. Yeah. Haha! Your assassination attempt failed. <laughs> the assassination on my life was unsuccessful. And left me scarred and deformed. <laughs> <laughs> you like the blah blah blah. I you know my penguins are lulls. Um I like it too. This this one is I, I actually love the story in this one. But mm -hmm. I know our streams are geared towards those people who are just like get this shit this going. This is TNA, baby. Ain't nobody got time for that. Mm hmm Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. God, no wonder we yeah. did a musical episode. Uh yeah, okay, let's take a look at the board here. <laughs> Uh, we are down. Oh God. Uh, yeah, we're down here. The museum. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I feel like I snagged that last clue, probably. I think so. So let's start there. Uh, five up. Cool. Successful. Clue. Um. Got it for you. Do I? Just take a shot at discovering an ancient tablet here on the off chance that it matters, or is that a waste of an action? Well, this, I mean, the skull, you're only one up, right? Yeah. The skulls are minus two. I think we, we save that action. Honestly, I, I okay. want to go back to the streets of Cairo. Okay. And grab one, or... Yeah, no, that's, that's right. Yeah, well, what's this the... one's good to mine. You want to just do one per turn. So move, investigate. Three up. Feel another. Oh, sorry. I'm on Minus the wrong. Two. And that's a clue. All right. <laughs> hey, Kahuna, you've already done as well as my last trip to Egypt, where Ursula and Tommy got one cultist. This scenario <laughs> can turn on you on a dime. It, it's. It's. Yeah. It's a constant struggle to keep your head above water. Mm hmm. And like. It can turn on you early. It can turn on you late. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. All right. That abyss gain strength. That's real rough. <laughs> that's our board state. Going into refresh. Okay, I got my 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 safety key here. Oh, look at you with your cult lexicon. Yeah. Excellent. Three doom of seven. Nice. Ooh. Um, that I is all. I feel like you just take this one. Yep. So I am two to two. So the worst I can do, I'm going to take a damage and a horror. That's what's going to happen. Mm -hmm. No, I'm oh, not. You're not? No, apparently <laughs> I'm good. Cool. Don't let it be one of the... Oh, it's the fucking imp! I knew it! Oh, I hate these guys so much because they add to the abyss, but they don't take away when you defeat them. They certainly They're don't. just assholes. Mm-hmm. I mean, they take away when you defeat them, but only if you're, like, screwed anyway. Yeah. Uh, you probably need me I really me don't to... like the imbalance between two or lower or five or higher. That's just... Mm -hmm. God damn it, Matt. Why do you hate us so much? Okay, do you mean to come deal with him? I wouldn't mind it. Do you mind if I shoot at you? I'll be four uh, up. Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, I'm going to play out my automatic. Second action. I'm going to move on over. 
Rock it on over. Uh, oh yeah. Once you play a card, the thingy don't come out again. And then, uh, third action. He is a fight of three. So I'm going so to pull out my gun. And shoot. So I'm a three, four, five, six, seven. And that plus two on the automatic is just... It's... It's pretty baller. Yeah. All right. Nice. Two damage, and I'll beat Cop. Last one. Nice. Deet. Doesn't remove anything, because he's an asshole. Uh, I feel like this is the reverse of uh, our TFA run-through, where I was the Clover. I just asked you guys mm -hmm. to clear the way. Yeah. 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 I mean, that's exactly what this is. Shit. I'm, uh... I'm going to get us another cultist, since it can't spawn here. Sure. Uh, I will shuffle three times. One, two, three. It's this bad boy. The museum. Oh. Sure. Cannot be damaged while there's a ready Search monster. A monster. Uh. So... The problem is, we could go grab one of the little guys, but it's going to frickin' add another strength to the Abyss. Mm -hmm. Or we can add a thing in the sarcophagus, which is just a bullet sponge. I think... Little guy? I think... Yeah, you think so? Well, the, okay, let's take a look at... It gets to a four. No, wait, no, wait, hang on. Two or lower, it adds one. So it wouldn't add one. Yeah. So you're right. Yeah. Bolts, uh, little guy. I always forget that, at least. But how do we deal with him again? Um, he, you mean his backside? His, yeah. his extra thing? We just have to kill him, right? I think he is. No. He is the. Is he, is he the bot an old trinket or like sacrificed a thing? I can't remember what his backside is. And now we can't look, so. Alright. Oh my god, JG Wentworth. Now that's a name I've not heard <laughs> in a long time. JG Wentworth. <laughs> Did they it's... have that in Canada too? I thought he was. Well, on the American movie. channels, yeah. Ah, yeah. Alright, um. I didn't think Canada was nearly as litigious as to need the expertise no. of J.G. Wentworth. No. Lit, uh, okay. Litigy like that is limited to $4,000, actually. Yeah, okay. That makes yeah. sense. Can't sue people for, like, a sore neck. Anyways. I'm going to invest... Should I investigate? Maybe I are mean... We just gonna, are we going to get two cultists and stick there? Uh... What does clues get us? Nothing, really. Right? That's kind of what I'm wondering. I think you get clues just to get more cultists. Yes. Okay. And then you move to either Cairo or Temple. Okay. Okay, so... You're three up? I will... Should I get another clue? Are we going for three? Do we have enough time for three? I don't think we have enough time for three. We're only at three of seven. All right, sure. We'll get a clue. Yeah. Or we'll try for it. Three up. Cool. One. And then last action, I'll play down my occult box. Oh, you need to I got to go get blood rights, don't I? Uh, go to the, the far left. You'll find them there. I'm streaming, so I can't. Well, I could. Here, you know what? The, it, We're going to have a lesson. Place. Uh, here we go. Bonded. Ooh. Oh, right on. Lovely. And I'm just going to grab your stars of right right now. Because I know you don't yes, have those either. Uh, and then I'm also going to grab my <laughs> mirror ones. We're all about professionalism here. Mm -hmm. 
professionalism and efficiency. Yeah. And at least zero of those is on display today. <laughs> you know, I need to use my, my skids markers because I am forgetting if I have taken my turn or not. You have to use your skid marks. My skid marks. Yeah. Okay. Lovely. All right. I believe that is refresh. We do have enemies, but he's not a hunter, right? A little gremlin. Correct. Okay. Refresh. Another beat cop. You got a deduction. Yeah, I did. All right. Numero four. Dark Ooh. sacrifice. A dark sacrifice. All right, so this is the one that can take people into the abyss. So we have to be yes. careful with that one. Uh, put into play in your threat area if there's no copy in your threat area. If not, again, surge. After strength is added to the abyss, take a damage to horror. If it, def if it defeats an ally or investigator, they get taken by the abyss. After strength is removed from the abyss, discard it. So it does nothing inherently right now, but it's kind of like TCU where they pile up in your display. And yeah. A darker sacrifice. All right. Well. Uh, my penguins are lulls. Uh, patron is per creation. That is the main podcast only. TNA, AV Club, all our solo stuff. That is all extra stuff we're doing because patrons are amazing. Um, yeah. Patron is only the main uh, once every two weeks cast. And if we skip a week, then it, it skips a week. Whenever we put out a, like a, a main podcast. Mm -hmm. All right, so... Oh, we each got one. Actually, got a little bit of a reprieve on anything to deal with right now, but we'll yeah. see, how, see how it goes with those building up. Um. Hmm. Shall we go in and deal with Doctor Wentworth? J. G. Wentworth. Because if you can kill the creature from the abyss, then you can just beat cop Doctor Wentworth, and then the only I thing... can go work on whatever he needs. Yeah. Um, or only play thing clean it, up with mind over matter should need be. The only thing is, can I defeat him this turn? Which I don't think I can. Um, or defeat all of them at least. Because I have to move down. Like I, I'd love to actually get my second beat cop out. Because then I'm just in punching range of stuff. But that's a whole turn. If you're okay with that. Sure. I'm, yeah. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. Lovely. You know, I'm going to put it in my body slot. Because... <laughs> Seems good. Anyways, I have charisma. I'll put it over here. <laughs> uh, oh, yep. s sorry, a uh, question from chat. Streets has one clue left. Yes. Yep, I forgot to delete that one. So thank you. All right. Two actions left. Thank you, my penguins are lulls. Who is Network 57, I believe. Right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Correct. And yes, thank you. We appreciate, we appreciate your support. Got You're... some fun stuff lined up for the near future, so... Oh, boy, do we. Mm -hmm. Right. You have two um, actions left, yeah? Uh, no, I, I gained a resource, gained a resource, played a beat cop. Oh, okay. That's my turn. Yeah, unfortunately. So. Gotcha. Okay, that's why you were asking for permission. Cause you just yeah. sat and played with yourself. I did. Fuck. Speaking of which, I will be right back. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll give a quick shot of the board here. Uh, there's one clue back where Sean is, and I'll focus on him. I'll be back in like 45 seconds. Bye. No, oh, sure. Um, well, my turn's going to be pretty simple. First action, I'm going to investigate again. We'll go three up, because that seems fine. Draw a skull, which is currently minus three, so great. That's a, that's a clue. Um, grab a resource, because eventually I want to be able to pay for things. 
And then I feel like I grab us our other cultists and we kind of we we chart our nearest path to <sighs> Yeah, cuz we already got the one that spawns here, so we'll be fine. Yeah, so I'm going to grab a cultist. Two clues down. We will shuffle. Shuffle and shuffle. And we get Farid, the CD salesman. And he goes. Alright, what I miss? And what did the viewers uh, miss? I it no, nothing. I investigated, got the clue, and then got us our other cultist. So we've got Farid at the bazaar. Okay. Um it's an intellect seven test. But you can spend which... five resources to Oh, right. yeah. That'll be fine. I can take care of that next turn. Okay. Um, Let's see. What was the other thing I was going to say? Uh, that was two actions for you? Uh, well, and then I got a, uh, a resource. Oh, okay. So I figured I might need them eventually, and Farid has validated that particular choice. All right. Let's do this. All right. Um, enemy phase. No hunters. Nothing. Okay. Refresh. Boom. Boom. Oh, hi, Lita Chandler. Oh, oh, I got a premonition. That means I know exactly the price that Farid is mm. going to ask. Yes. Oh, you got Lita. Nice. Well, you know what? My, my other beat cop is almost dead. Although I'm really worried about Lita because she could be taken into the abyss, which would be f <laughs> like super hilarious. That definitely leaves us one less option for Devourer. <laughs> because I fully expect that we'll need to push Lita at Immortoth by the time we get there. Yeah. Uh, did you already add Doom? I did not, but I will. Oh, so we're at five. Right there. Okay. okay, yep. I well, we were less than that, but I guess we're... Nope. Remember you <gasps> took a whole turn to do nothing? Location with the most clues... That's any location right now. Oh boy. It yeah. gains Hunter when it has no clues, so. Or Expedition Camp, and I can deal Give with it, it time, later. Sure. sure. That's a problem for later me. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the right answer? I feel like if we are going to try to complete two cultists, we need to buy ourselves. Two more yes. cultists. We need to yeah, buy you're right. Time, you're so. right. Yeah. If we're being ambitious, then yes. Knight of what, Zealot? <laughs> My favorite <laughs> levels, yeah. She didn't even show up. Any Cairo location and aloof. With the Brotherhood enemy, if able. Uh, I think I'll put him with Farid. Because I don't think that's going to... Wait, does it stop me from parlaying? Cannot be It'd attacked be attack or, damage. or damaged. But it's not going to stop me from parlaying, so I feel like that's fine. Okay. <laughs> And what does Dr. Wentworth need? Can someone look that up for us? I mean, Cause... we could just flip the card if we're going to metagame at that. Ah, uh, yeah. Here we go. Sabotage the train. Oh! <laughs> that's not happening. Uh, <laughs> all right. So maybe we leave him alone. Maybe we're only getting two cultists. We'll see. Maybe. Farid needs the, uh, um, the translated tablet or whatever. Discovered an ancient tablet? Yes. So this one? Perhaps. Okay, so I'm just going down here and killing things. No, never mind. We broke into a deserted temple. He needs the top one. Temple, okay. Temple courtyard. All right. Okay. Um, okay. Um, so my first act, or my first non-action is going to be to play Premonition and see what we need to set up here. Mm-hmm. Opening round premonition is a zero. I'm gonna go. I wanna go. Yep. Parlay with Farid. Yep. Okay. So first action move. Uh, I got those clues for you. A couple clues. Can yeah, I don't know what the clues aren't spawning on this one, but there they are. He's gonna hop down with me. 
Uh, second action, I will parlay, and I'll go ahead and spend one resource to reduce the difficulty of that test by one. So I'm six to six. I draw a zero. Thank you, Premonition. And he goes... Uh, the victory display. Yeah. All right, so I just need to break into a deserted temple, which... Is that a... Is that an attack? A combat test? I think it is. I don't know. We're going to find out. I'll move up there. <laughs> All right. Combat five. I mean, I'm at combat five. Bless you. Do you always sneeze in threes? I do. I'm a triplet sneezer. Um, My wife is as well. Yeah, it's, it's a thing. Before you leave Cairo Bazaar, do you want to grab clues or play items? I guess you don't have a action, but... Nah, I'm good. No? The only thing that I'd have to play is my lab assistant, which would cost more there, so... Okay. So am I just going to go kill this guy for victory points? Is that what's going to happen? I think you should come up here and hit this test so we can lower the strength of the abyss and get rid of these dark sacrifices. I just don't know if I can actually hit that test. Unless you have really combat, to aren't hit me. you like plus three combat? Three, four. I'm at five. Oh, six. You're at six, bro. Okay, okay. Seems pretty surmountable. I could chuck you a blood a blood right if you like miss it the first time. So let's see. I'm one up. I have nothing to. Maybe I draw as a second action? What do you have to commit to me? A blood right. It's probably... Blood right or a ward. I mean, I guess I could chuck you a mind over matter, but... That's... It's, it's dicey. I think I draw first, and then we reevaluate. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Okay, no. so nothing. Um, could you shoot it? I can't shoot the temple. I wish you. Could, I wish you could shoot it. Well, you know what? Let's. Uh, I'm one up. The, oh god, there's just so many minus threes. Mm -hmm. you need, I need to look at the bag again. How many minus twos do we have? That's a pass. Minus two gets rid of. No. Well, uh, at, at plus two, I get rid of two tokens. I don't know if that's worth it. I don't know if it is either. Okay. Up by, up by one. <sighs> Good thing we didn't commit. All right. Uh, enemy phase. This guy hunts. This guy does not do anything. And that's it. Yeah. Refresh. Play. Get. Ooh, crack the case. Okay. Six or seven doom. Witching hour. Dad, look at the sun, skids. Uh, I'm gonna take this one. I'm just gonna tank it. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I will take two horror or choose an ally asset at your location to be defeated. I think I'm just gonna like take the two horror on the beat cop. Sure. And just just losing him that way doesn't give him to the abyss, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine then. I'll take two horror. I mean, anyway. he's non-unique, so it doesn't really matter. Mm -hmm. Another supplicant. Uh, with a brotherhood, if able. So that's here. Okay. Uh, is where, sorry? Oh, down here, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, um... 
Want me to test this breaking through? Oh, yes, and thank you, Programs with Wolves. He moved down here because we got rid of Farid. So they're all huddled up on the nearest Brotherhood. Oh, okay. Yep. God, I wish I... Oh, man, I should put in dynamite. Can you imagine that? That'd be one hell of a dynamite right now. <laughs> a sick dynamite. Um... Okay, uh, first action, play Lita. Second action... God, do I dare ask you for your blood right? Here's the deal. Be three up. Yeah. I have mind over matter, which would put me at six. At the test. That's right. And I'm not, like... Pre-attached back the case. Sorry, you're breaking like, up, Sean. You gotta say that oh, all start. again. Yeah. Can, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Um. So so I'd be one up on the test, and I'm not like crazy attached to crack the case. Okay. Yeah, I I I don't think I need crack the case stuff either. So. Okay. That's a free icon there. And I think. I can afford, like, deduction's great and, you know, speed's good. But maybe you can just, at six willpower, well, you're probably good. You're yeah, saying? For, for, for the sake of what this is, yeah. and how important this test is, mm -hmm. I feel like I can afford it. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, spin one, play mind over matter. Action one. Six to five. Try this test. Commit crack. Seven to five. Eight to five. Commit deduction. Re up. Okay. <laughs> well, <laughs> there it is. Up. Yeah. Fine. Fine, but that's fine because we broke into a deserted temple, which reduces the strength of the abyss and gets rid of both dark sacrifices. So I feel like that's worth it. I feel like I, I think. Yeah. It is what it is. You got the ears gone. Oh, yeah. There you go. Okay, um, is it worth it for me to get any more clues, or do we want to start doing another thing? Well, okay, so how many, how many, we have two cultists, right, that we've dealt with? Mm-hmm. I'm not getting these guys this turn. Yeah, that's, what if you moved, that's a cluster that can't be unfucked. What if you moved to the outskirts and evaded the thing in the sarcophagus? Because of your... At a two? Yeah, that seems fine. No, you're a six. Well, no, he's, his evade is at a two. Right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, that seems fine. So, second action move. Oh. Um, third action evade at four up. Minus two. He's evaded. Oof. Done. Okay. Um, I'll come down here. I'll sabotage the trip. No, just kidding. <laughs> I mean, we never got Dr. Wentworth, though. Mm hmm. This is the problem. Huh. These guys are all just going to stay here. Okay. I have not played this scenario in a very long time. <laughs> Any chance you can adaptable in a, uh, a dynamite blast mid scenario? I uh, cannot. That works. Not actually. How cool would that be if like level three adaptable let you do let you do that mid scenario? Yeah. Um. This guy's gonna stay here board. because we have because there's gonna be clues, right? Oh, but next round we remove all clues from Cairo locations. Yep. Yep. Well, Expedition Camp, does it have clues? I can't remember, but probably not. But here's the thing. You've got mm. Lita damage, so you can shoot him, punch him once, and he's done. And while he's evaded, you risk nothing. That's true. How, but we also shuffle back in the encounter deck, I think? I mean, maybe, but I still think it's worth killing him. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Because I can't move, so either way we're going to have to address him next. Okay, so I will shoot him. 
So I am a three, four, five, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to three. Are you kidding me? This kid is so good. <laughs> okay. All right. Could you not? <sighs> okay. Eight to three. So you can still punch him twice and then beat cop him once. I think that's the better option, actually. Three, four, answer. five, six to three. So three up. Minus cool. two. Three up. Good. Cool. And then, I'll be, and then I'll beat cop him. Five damage. Deed. Deed, because he's a monster. God, Lita is just unbelievable. Lita is... We will never see the likes of her again as an ally. You know, you know what? I'm kind of sad that campaign allies aren't a little bit more like, hey, you should play these. Like more like Lagrasse? That campaign. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like when you're in that campaign, I feel like we should really want to play with the story characters. Mm -hmm. But there are some story characters when they're costed and balanced like normal allies that just are like, why would I play this? There's campaigns so, uh, that... I've played where we just don't take any of the story allies. Like, yeah. even when we're yeah. offered, we're like, nah. Like, it's just going to dilute my deck, and yeah. Yeah. And that's the thing. It's like, she doesn't have any icons, so, you know, there's that. She's mm -hmm. not, like, the perfect campaign ally. Mm hmm <laughs> But she is really funny. I mean, zero cost, plus one combat, <laughs> plus one really damage to monsters, free. three three soak. Yeah. Um, it kind of reminds me of... I played... Uh, a game of Lord of the Rings, the card game, with a guy mm. like seven, six years ago-ish at the Board Game Geek convention in mm -hmm. Dallas. And we I forget what, what scenario we played or what adventure, whatever it was, but the location actually had a beneficial thing when you explored it. Yeah. And he even mentions like, hey, remember when locations were beneficial? I was like, oh yeah, yeah. that was cute. <laughs> It's like, remember when the story sometimes rewarded you for doing it? Mm hmm. All right, refresh. You got a. Alt lexicon oh, card. Right. Blood right. I get. Say your prayers. Ooh. Which I'm not at yet. Uh, nothing hunts. Thank God. Nothing did hunt. We hit seven, so we advance. Find each Brotherhood enemy currently in play. Place each of those enemies beneath the snare reference card out of play. Shuffle each set aside of Abyssal Revenant into the encounter deck, along with the discard pile. Add one strength to the Abyss. Yeah. I like so, it. So. Good thing we got rid of those dark sacrifices, though. Good thing. All right. Um. we go it's funny is usually when you uh stream you talk to people and you keep people going and i do all the the nitty-gritty but people get to witness yeah. the nitty-gritty this time so <laughs> i mean i suppose i could just keep talking i'm getting real lazy now um i mean you are but you did raise our yeah. you did raise our i did abyss, i did so uh, and we I also feel like most people don't come to Mythos Busters for the mechanical brilliance because <laughs> if they did, they'd be very quickly and very sorely disappointed. Well, they come for both the mechanical brilliance and also not the mechanical brilliance at the same time. <laughs> Is that fair? I feel like we're the content producers who glorify showing our imperfections. All right. And uh, I'm honestly a little proud of that. All right. So we advance to. Uh, act 1B. <laughs> that is what MB stands for, Mechanical Brilliance. <laughs> oh my god, April Fool's episode. Mechanical Brilliance. <laughs> um, can you search the encounter deck? Let's talk deck? about click economy. Can you uh, search the encounter deck for me? And I'm going to yep. name out the cards you need. Uh, need. Oh yeah, for the exploration deck, yeah. Terra under the pyramids. Terra, under the pyramids. Cairo, city on the move. Swarm of locusts. Okay. Locusts. Abyssal reach. Abyssal 
Reach? Eclipse! You have to pay extra for an Abyssal Reach nowadays. And this is the or Daily Double. It's the, uh, the music hint. <laughs> Sandstorm. Oh, yeah, okay, I missed the, 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 the rude uh, reference there. There we go, Sandstorm. Right. Holy crap, really? Did you grow up in the 90s? I, I, okay, so real confession would be vulnerable with you guys here for a minute. I completely <laughs> missed the train on that meme. I don't know why. I can't even explain it. Um, but I missed it. And, like, I, I, I've seen it referenced enough times since to know what it is. But, yeah. Not I mean, to my, uh, it's only been a meme for, like, 12 years. So. <laughs> and we had to remove all clues from Cairo locations. There you go. Um, so you put... Um, oh, there's J.P. Wentworth. He goes under here somewhere. <laughs> I think these guys are also... They start underneath the thing. The scenario reference card. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah. Okay, let's make sure we did all that. Uh, we added one strength, yet we're at three... Mm -hmm. We lose all our clues, remove all clues from Cairo oh. locations. Ah, I knew it. Yeah. Knew there was no point. So if the strength of the Trap. abyss ever hits zero, we actually increase it to one. We draw a card and heal a horror. And over here, clues cannot be placed on Cairo locations. If you're in an expedition location, explore. Explore. All right. Okay. Let's do this. We are at zero of six doom. Godspeed, everyone. Here's Act Two. Act One went pretty dark right. sacrifice. A dark sacrifice. Swarm of locusts. Okay. Um, you know, I could afford to lose my resources. Like, I don't want to, but I can afford it, so it's fine. Yeah, you're probably. Well, I'm okay. running with a really light rig this game. Yeah, you are. Um. Okay, one down. All right, so I lose two. That's fine. Could have been worse. All right. Um. Okay. Who's better to take on the encounter deck or the exploration deck? P probably me, given how many willpower tests are in there unfortunately right yep i yep. think so i mean i feel like you asked the question but you definitely already knew the answer <laughs> i appreciate you giving me the illusion of agency yeah. perhaps so a <laughs> first action move um god is that parlay test worth it you think one sec i'm gonna redo my camera because you don't like discard them you just put them on the bottom they're gonna get shuffled in again fuck it it ain't worth it it ain't worth it. Right? Um, I mean, unless you, like, really stop me, I'm just going to say that ain't worth it. No, I don't think it's worth it. Just, it doesn't, like, discard them like the torches or anything. Yeah. It just shuffles them back in, so we're going to see them again. Yeah. I'm just not going to waste the action. Let's just As, muscle uh, our way big, through it here. Big Kahuna says, just tank it. No blanket, just tank no it. blanket. <laughs> All right, second action, explore. That's the wrong button. All right, give me what I got here. <laughs> uh, let's make sure this is all shuffled. You get clips. Totally clips. Are you? Uh, you know what? That's fine. I can take a couple of horror. One up. Woo! Okay. Two that's up. Done. Explore. Okay, explore again. Oh god. Uh. Oh. Sorry, I oh, thought sorry, sorry. I thought I was doing sorry, it. Sorry, One sorry. sec. Okay. Um what is that? A heart? It is not heart connected. Heart does not connect. Swarm of locusts. Oh no. Uh well. 
Okay. That's just happening. Um, you know what? In the fast... Ooh, this could be bad, but I also realize that I've kind of made a boo-boo here in not doing something I meant to do. I see. Uh, yeah, I do. You yeah. want to play open okay. gate? Yeah, so in the fast action window here, mm -hmm. right? Yep. I played on my open gate, which is also my only <laughs> agility icon. <laughs> yes, so, it is. So I'll be taking this one naked. Okay. You might get the plus one. one. down. So I there's might get that. The plus one, or I might get three damage. So I hope you have that soothing melody in. I mean, I haven't played the mirror yet, but go ahead. <gasps> you, so you draw a card. You actually just draw a uh, card. No, only if I succeed. And that's a, that's a zero. Oh right, I forgot it. For some like, reason, I thought it was plus one plus per two. Zero, Matt. Come on. Yeah. I thought you liked Daisy. All right, whatever. I just take a damage because I can't lose any. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine. Jack Steampunk, we're doing good. That is my turn. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, let's see here. I think I just move on down because you've tanked a, <laughs> enough of it. Yeah, why not? Thanks, Daisy, for doing all the hard work. Uh, that one goes in the discard pile. That goes back in there. Hmm. Net or uh, net? Yeah, network is singing. No. Turn around. Turn around. Every now and then I get a little bit tense, and you never come. Need some work, but we can work it out. Uh, yeah. I guess I just explore because there's meeting. there's nothing else to do. Oh wait, yeah, no, we're good. Okay. Uh, first action, move down. Second action is explore. Nope. What's what are we looking for? The, You're looking for the, a uh, a a crescent moon, an hourglass, or a plus sign. Or the yellow circle. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Well, good thing you have a robust hand. Yeah, but I ha oh, God, I have this say your prayers. Oh, sure. No, yeah, no, yeah, but you can't take the horror until your hand's empty, so... I know. But I'm saying, like, maybe I you handle this one? Oh. Do I? All right, fine. But, I mean... Do I though? Is that is that the right choice? I think so. Okay. So I'm one up, and I'm not like in love with anything in my hand. Okay. I'm running really lean this scenario. Yeah, it's actually the incredibly just lean. Keeps knocking me down every time I actually get something trying to build. All right. Well, uh, you are testing one up, sir. <clears throat> one up. Minus two. I think I'll lose a blood right. That was my second action. That was super successful because nothing happened to me. Well, we're like true to explore. We're th like we knocked out most of those treacheries before we even get the first goddamn location. So. We did. Yep. All right. Looking for yellow. What I'm looking for. Nope. Nope. That one will do it. Yay. Dunes. Actually, I'm going to check the map here. Hmm. There's a map. Dunes goes over to the Boy. side. Oh my god, it's a map and it looks like a pyramid! Huh! Huh! Who knew? And then we need clues. This is my third action. Take one damage. Republic Life Human, you are not wrong. Daisy is super sad. She hasn't gotten to use her ability one goddamn time this turn, this whole game. I take but that's also partially Probably my fault because I took out Old Book of Lore. Uh, Programs with Old says we discard the locations that were under... I don't think I did. I think I... You're right, I did. Oh, whoopsie. 
That, that's fine. It was not. Uh, those are the, the things you got there. Oh, yeah. Those weren't. Yeah. No, we're good. We would have kept going anyway. Those were essentially explore surge. Yeah. Let me just make sure here. We should only have one treachery left. Yep. And do we already do sandstorm? Locations? No. Do we do abyssal no, reach? The one we, we nope. Those oh, are there five treacheries? Yeah, there are five treacheries. We've gotten rid of three. Okay. Yep. Okay. So, we're yep. good. Yep. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I have to either take a damage or lose an action. I have no action, so I must. Uh, take a damage, which I will just take on Lita, because I want to okay. strategically lose Lita when it won't send her to the abyss. Fair. Yeah. And then, oh no, no, I already put it on there. Oh, sorry, I thought she already had one. Uh, and then, fast. can we explore from any desert location? Does it have to be no any, clues? Any expedition location. So, yes, from where you're at, you can explore. With no clues? I don't think it has to be. No, clues. yeah, it doesn't. Um, no, go ahead and open it up. It, it, well, I'm just wondering because I'd have to pay for another action. Right. Did you take out Old Book of Lore? Sorry, Jack's Team Punk asking. asking. I did. Uh, this <gasps> deck... Okay, all right, first of all. Hand slots are an issue, and mm -hmm. the tote bag, well, cool. Only steers never boats. shows up when you need it. Only deals with water, uh, yep. Yeah, so, so and, you know, I'll, I'll admit this isn't the optimized daisy deck, but the point of this deck is to run those stones that deal damage when you draw cards, so I've got Scroll of Prophecies in here in lieu of Old Book of Lore because you draw three cards off of that and can do three damage. Yeah, that's fair. Yep. What, do you, what do you think of the new... Or the recently spoiled version of Old Book of Lore. I think it's pretty good. It, I mean, it functions it, like the old one with, but with two, well, like two secrets, two times a game. You can just immediately put the card you draw into play yeah, at so reduced good. cost. I think yeah. it's pretty good. Yeah, I've yet to play with it, so but it seems pretty good in multiplayer at least. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, enemy phase. Do we have any hunter things? I don't think so. Nope. No, these guys will move once there's a Brotherhood enemy in play, but right now right. there's not. Raw fresh. Ha, raw. It's a nice Egypt joke. <laughs> see what you did there. Ancient stones, also another Egypt joke. Huh. I don't get it. How long does time have to pass before um, grave robbing, or sorry, grave robbing becomes archaeology? That's a fascinating philosophical question. Um, One of six, Doom. I'm going to go at least 200 years. Okay. Oh okay. Oh, boy. Ooh boy. We need to remove some strength from the abyss for you. <laughs> yes, we do. Because, okay, so, so if you were to go dig up the grave of a soldier who died in the Civil War... Mm-hmm. That's that's still grave robbing at this point. Okay, George Washington. I don't know where he was buried. I feel like he was but buried. He's... Like... Oh, USA is not 200 years old yet. Is it? Hmm. Questions for another... No, so... anyways. Draw your card. Right, yeah, we're, we're 200 years old. We have the bicentennial. I mean, when, if we're, when did he die? From the... He died before, 18, when... before 1800. So is George Washington grave robbing? Grave robbing? Well, given that he's like, you know, a national figure. George I'm, I'm Washington. I'm talking about like... <laughs> Gent Washington. Yeah, okay. Anyways. Yeah. Excellent conversation for not now. <laughs> um, oh boy. I feel like that's not worth a ward. Either take two damage or discard an asset so you control. Probably just get rid of the occult lexicon if this hits, because it's probably going to hit. Okay, one sec. Before you click, what are your options? War. Ah, yeah, occult ward lexicon. Ward or get rid of my occult lexicon. And I feel like I'd rather hold on to the ward. Yeah. Yeah, just do it. 
Oh, for that plus one. There's two tokens in there. Oh, so close. Oh. All right, well. Cult lexicon goes by, so does blood right, so does blood right. No. Anyways, while you do that. Mm-hmm. Um... I realized I didn't, I didn't really show slumber. Uh, basically, I have to take two willpower tests every turn. If I fail, lose an action. And after strength is removed from the abyss, discard slumber. So we really want to... Um, remove abyss strength. That would be great. One thing, I'm just going to mention this out loud because I know I'll forget... If anything gets taken into the abyss, we have to raise the abyss by one. So whether oh, where it's... Does, where does that happen? That's in the rules, in the rules pamphlet thing. So anytime... What, really? So, yeah. So anything, anytime an ally or investigator is taken by the abyss, quote unquote, we need to raise the abyss number. So Wow, I am... I'm just saying that for chat. I'm 100% certain that I've never played that correctly. I'm pretty sure I have not either. I think I've played huh. the snare like three times total. So, hmm. uh, so I'm here. Wow. I can see why I got so salty on my first play of this one. Yeah. It's, it's a little mean sometimes. Um, what do we want to do for exploring? Uh, um, I feel like I'll I'll explore. And try to clear more of those treacheries, because we still got at least one of them in there that's a willpower test. Sounds good. We'll shuffle them up for you. Starting with you, we have... Yep. Uh, so that's that's our plan for the turn? Yeah? Yep. Okay. That's my plan. Uh, we need a yellow circle. That's not a yellow circle. We're looking for either the moon or the hourglass. Wow. There's there the we go. It's the Nile. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jeez. I'll take the horror, that's fine. Okay. Um, and then I feel like maybe I just go ahead and investigate a couple times. Sure. Four up. Well, one time, I guess. Oh, no, because... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Explore. Explore moves, right? It does, yeah. Okay, cool. I just forgot everything. One up. Four up. Minus zero. So two clues. So I grabbed both of them. Phew. Done. All right. Um, redo our explore deck. Thank you, Jacques. Good night, Jock. What if you had narcolepsy and slumber? Oof. You'd be having a real rough time. Hmm. Well, I mean, narcolepsy, you can only have multiplayer, so. But. I'm not sure. Um, I'm really confused with my skids deck right now, because there's nothing I can kill. <laughs> Did you slumber? I have not yet. Okay, let's do that. I'd recommend it. Hmm. Testing even. Ooh! Zero. All right. So I passed. Very nice. All right. I ignore any bonuses to my skill value, of which I have none. That's, that's a cool chaos token. Like, it's really simple, but it's really cool. It's mm -hmm. like, nope, fucking... You pass this test honestly, or you don't? Well, what's that, the third scenario in Carcosa? I always forget the name. Like the first Mythos pack. Uh, the uh, Echoes of the Past? Yeah. It has a room where it's like, you just... Yeah, you ignore yeah. all modifiers to your intellect, but it's a two-shroud. I'm going to put out Solid Mirror. Nice. Uh, so I get one. Take these two. So I feel like we're going to need this. And is this from any card or... <gasps> oh my god. I can heal my beat cops with this? Yeah, you can. I just realized that. 
Um, do I just start exploring? There's only two things I can... Untouched Vault and Sand Swept Ruins. What's, uh... Should I come back up hmm. and then... Hmm. Um, I mean... I feel like both of those are things we need to have in play, so maybe just go for them. Because what are you going to get from the expedition camp? There's one more thing to explore. You're probably going to hit the treachery first. Yeah. Which is abyssal, abyssal reach. Yeah. Abyssal reach. Abyssal. But I might also hit sand. Junior. Okay, anyways. <laughs> uh, so that was my first action to do... I need to start using my action counters now. Oops. Untouched Vault. That's one of them. Nice. And that is the corner one. Ooh, that's the one where if you, like, kill a monster there, you get to remove it straight from the abyss. Oh, good. Because I'm sure yeah. it's not getting the clues off of it. Uh... Second action was to investigate or that thing. Um, should I just. God, I. Like. I'm so torn because I, I don't feel like I can handle that treachery. Um, just quiche. Just quiche, eh? I think that's. Yeah. I, yeah. Okay. Yeah, store some actions for later. Fair enough. In your money in your money bank. Mm-hmm. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Alright, so enemy phase. Nothing. Nada. Alright. Ra fresh. Flashlight. Interesting. What'd you get? Deny? Got another deny, so. All right. I live to fight another day in the future. Two of six. Oh, there you go. Who has the most clues? Me. Yep. Take it. Take All it. Right. Kill it and remove a strength from the abyss. Oh my goodness. That was well timed. Matthew, thank you. Stare into its dead eyes, Scott. Mm -hmm. Uh, and for me. Sandstorm. Again? Uh, or discard an asset you control. You know what, if I, if I fail this, I'll just deny the damage. That's what it's there for. Yeah, that's fair. Two Maybe dam at some point in this game, I'll have either a big hand or resources to play stuff with, <laughs> but it is not this day. Yep, just take it. Two tokens say you pass. Nah. Yeah. No. Okay, fine. I'll take two damage and deny it. Okay. Um. So you're here. Do your work. Okay, I'll do my work. So five health, three combat. Uh, I am going to step one. Fight with a gun. Three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Eight to three? It's plus two fight because of the location. But that's fine. You're still three up. Okay. So that is damage? That's three damage. Punch it! I think I'm going to commit on Ooh, the land. Also, before you go any farther, yep. before you go any farther, don't forget slumber. Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, slumber, I am up, but I'm even. So. Oh boy. Oh. Three or lower. Oh no! Oh! 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 <laughs> oh! I passed. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah. That yeah. right there, like, if we had, like, a TSN turning point, that was the uh, skill was test <laughs> to pass right there. <laughs> yep. Uh, so now I need to punch this guy. So I'm three, four, five. He's plus one fight. 
<laughs> he's plus two. He's a five. Oh, he's a five. Uh, gosh. Commit on the lamb. But that only gives me plus two, though. Like, I'm three, four, five. He's plus two fight. So I'm two up. You're three, four, five. If I spend my, six, my gun. Seven. Sure. Yeah, okay. Or just shoot him. That's fine. Yeah. Well, I think end commit, right? Because three, okay. four, five, six, seven, yeah, I eight. Mean, getting the... Getting the strength of the abyss down right now, pretty good. So I think okay, like that's worth it. Still, I'm three up without on the lamb. Do I go to four up? If you miss this test, what's your plan? Uh, to die. Just punch with on the lamb. Six. Yeah. So I'm three up. Three up. Okay, he's dead. Nice. Which lowers the abyss. I won. No, you gotta... Oh, whoa, I forgot about this. You actually have to take the action to do it, so good thing you succeeded. I suppose you could have paid two resources, but... So you have to take the action to remove the strength of the abyss and stare into its dead eyes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Anyways. I stare into its dead eyes. The test still succeeds. It's just I need an action to actually lower the abyss. Mm -hmm. I won. Which you have done. Oh, not up here. There we go. Oh, do you still have a beat cop? Oh, yeah, you were, you were more than that. We were forgetting your tarot, and I was forgetting your beat cop. I was going, no, I'm a tarot. I'm six combat. He was five uh -huh. combat. Right. Okay. Yep. And I yeah, shot him for the last shot. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm good. We did it right. It's fine. Uh, so I shot him twice. My third action. Your third action was to remove the strength from this. Right. Okay. Now, do I want to take an extra action to put out, like, flashlight or something? Like, am I actually going to, uh, like, investigate something here? Not there. Sand, sand swept ruins, maybe? Yeah, where do you... Where else do you connect to from there, the ruins? Yeah, yeah. it's all going to be... At minus two or whatever, um, you know I'm gonna put out a I'm gonna put out my flashlight just in case. Honestly, just in case I have an action available. No, I don't have an action yet. Cause I shot shot. Mm -hmm. Shot shot. Yeah, location yeah. ability. Right. No, I'm. So you I'm, have to pay for one if you want to do anything else. No, I'm good. Okay. All right. What the hell am I doing? Probably I'm going to leave it on you. I'll be back. I just need another beer. Or okay, do I? <laughs> <laughs> well, you're getting one. I'm, I'm going to resource because I'd really like to not die to my... Uh, when I'm off on my own with this particular deck, like I'd love to scrap this deck, guys. If I'm being honest with you, this campaign has really gone astray on me. This mob enforcer just really cramps my style with this draw lots of cards deck. I'm going to get a resource so that way when the refresh comes around, I'm going to be at four. And if I find my mob enforcer, I'll have an option to deal with him. Then I'm going to explore. Shifle. <laughs> Another fucking sandstorm. All right, well, this one's probably just going to happen. Um, or Scott's not here. I might just cancel this one. There's still an Abyssal Reach in the deck? We haven't seen that yet. Damn it. So that's only at a 2. That's a damage and a horror. Ooh, yep, screw it. I don't care what Scott says. I'm canceling this. He can get angry at me if he wants to. Last action, explore. And desert. This is connected to where I'm at. So hop in. Down. Uh. 
I'm back. All right, well, I explored, got a treachery, canceled it, and explored again. Um, and now I'm at the Desert Oasis. All right. You have no oh, horror man, on I you. I forgot about the double action on this one. Too bad I'm not going to be able to use it. Yeah, no kidding. God, I got it. All right, that's All what right. it is. Let me clean up these tokens here. <laughs> there we go. Uh, okay, nothing hunts. No, Republic Life Human, you're wrong. The Ancient Stones combo is great in Daisy. This was just the first deck I tried it in, and I've since built multiple drafts off of this deck, and it's gotten better. It's not great here. <laughs> I wish I had practiced first. But, you know, it is what it is. All right. Is that, uh, that's my turn. Uh, that's your turn. No hunters. Refresh. One sec. Uh, Mrs. Keg's difficulty. Uh, this is based on our, um... No, I think that's Mr. Skeggs. Oh. I mean, Mr. That's, that's just Alex, right? Oh. Maybe? Alex? Hello? <laughs> oh, hi, Alex. <laughs> Yeah. Alex, uh, yeah. this, this is Knight yeah. of the Zealot with every single side thing ever thrown in. So, so we're Midnight Masks level of uh, the Knight of the Zealot bag. Yeah. So no Elder thing yet. Have you increased the Doom yet? I have not, but I will. That is Maybe too bad. Did. No, I did. I'm I'm just checking to make sure. But we're at three of six. There you are. Farthest, Farthest. Desist, desert. Uh, so with you? It's just farthest from you? Yep. Ugh. Okay, that's fine. There you go. Fine. You want to ward that? Ooh, no. A dark sacrifice. All right, well, that's okay. That's just the way it's going to go right now. I guess you need to mind over matter to evade? I think I do. I don't. I like, you know, as much as I want to hate on this Daisy deck and as many improvements as I could make on it, have made on it, mm -hmm. I've played two assets this entire game, and I'm still, I'm still participating. You're I'm still, still pulling my weight. <laughs> Still doing your twenty five percent. All right now. I no, I'd That's not say how that math works. No, yeah. I'd say you're doing uh, well above average. I mean, five intellect to start. Then you With had yellow Saint cards, Hubert's key. You just can't go wrong. Like you're a six four two two. That's pretty good. Yep. So yeah. Or sorry, right. four six so, two two. I will uh, mind over matter. I'll evade at four up. Great. Thanks, Elder Sign, for coming out now that I have no tomes in play. Fine, though. It's evaded. Um, I'll explore for two. What am I looking for? Uh, sorry, I stepped away for a quick second. You're looking for a heart. Sorry. I'm look yeah, okay. Oh, you do it the opposite way that I look at it, which is probably smarter. Looking for a heart on the card that I pull. Mm -hmm. Yes. That'll do it, unfortunately. And that is... Uh, here? Uh, yeah, the middle. Yeah. And as an additional cost to explore here, you must spend two resources, which I'm not terribly interested in doing. So I'm just going to gain one. And that's my turn. Sounds good. Um, what do we need clues for? We need three. I have zero. You have two. Um...
So I'm not going to get uh, clues at Untouched Vault. Fair. And Sandswept Ruins is a three shroud. So I'm going to head up here. I'm actually going to play my flashlight. Yeah. And I'm, I'm going to try at uh, two up. Sure. Because there's a lot of tokens that make me pass here. That is one of them. Beauty? This is me doing my 25%. Um, do I pay resources to... No. For an extra action? I don't think I do. I think I, I save my resources for a bigger weapon. I realize I have an enchanted blade, but uh, that's going to mm. bump up my 45. Um, sure. Well, your 45 is empty, so. Well, that's what I mean. Like, do I pay two resources just to try and investigate it two oh. up again? I don't I think I do. I don't think you do. I don't figure your location, right? Yeah, no. All right. That's that. Abyssal readies, or I guess Hunter, nothing happens. We refresh the Abyssal readies. Steadfast. All right. Hmm. All right. Four of six. All right. Slumber again. Eclipse. This is fine. Yeah. One up. Sweet. One down. There you go. Perfect. Okay. Um... I think I might explore from here. Costs you two. Which is fine. Actually, it's it does not... It's basically guaranteed to hit something. It does not connect to anything. Is everything that it connects to in play? Eldritch Gate is the only one that goes here, and it's not in this game. So, Faceless Sphinx does. Oh, okay. So, yeah, wow, okay, so everything it connects to is already in play. Okay, so never mind. So how um, many clues do you have? You have two, I have one. Why don't you come over on my branch? Okay, so first action and second action, because I don't want to take the damage, because I'm squishy and have no way to stop anything else at this point. Mm -hmm. um, and then explore for last action. Or, yeah, probably explore, yeah. You are looking for a plus Faceless sign. Sphinx? Nope. Looking for sand swept ruins. That's the one. There you go. Okay. Done. Um, I guess I'll investigate the dunes with my flashlight. I am three to one with my flashlight, so minus two. I pass. Nice. Doing my 35%. <laughs> Oh, uh, slumber. Two more clues to advance. Forgot slumber. Um, I'll just take mm -hmm. it even. All right. Wow. Wow. You've been, you've been very fortunate on your slumber pulls. Mm-hmm. Good things happen when you're sleeping. 
Good jobs, kids. Um. All right, I'm gonna step away for a quick sec. Yeah. <laughs> Sean didn't mute. What a noob. Um, I think I probably have to go kill this Abyssal Revenant at some point. So I think what I'm going to do is... Let's flip these over. I investigated once uh, with the 7 to 4 resources. I'm going to put out my Enchanted Blade. That's my second action. Third action. Hmm. Second action, I'm actually going to draw. And third action, I'll play my thing. Okay. Sounds good. The unspeakable oath. But there's, let's look at chat here. Uh, yes, Ancient Stones is really good in Mandy with Mr. Rook. I mean, Mandy and Mr. Rook plus any card that exists is pretty good. Uh, Hunter, or Abyssal Revenant, moves up here. Uh, we refresh. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's how it is. <sighs> I'm back. Cool. Uh, you are refreshing, and I've I've given you a resource, and you need to draw a card. Sean, right. for my action, I investigated once, then I drew a card, and then I played my Enchanted Blade. And then I refreshed, and I drew Unspeakable Oath, Bloodthirst, and then Hospital mm -hmm. Debts. So I'm getting minus four experience in this scenario. <laughs> oh my god. There's, there's time. There's time. There is time. I can actually possibly um, pay off hospital debts. Mm -hmm. In fact, I'm going to pay off two in the refresh phase. Seems good. Because um, I have a... All my cards are zero or one, and... I have some decent money. Sure. And we are not together. All right. Anyways. Uh, five of six. Five of six. What the hell? Yeah. The most clues. Oh, wait. The Abyssal Revenant. Did he hunt? He, he, he did, did hunt, okay. yeah. yeah. Uh, do you want to put this guy over here? Yep. Okay. Done. Year ago. Abyssal Reach. Fine, I'm two up. Yeah. Cool. Bye. All right. Um, I'll investigate twice. I think I do. Right. Particularly since I don't have five cards in my hand at this point. Yeah. So, three up. Draw another. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fine. Clue. Done. Three up. Ooh, that's, that's less. That's, less that's fine. It's fine. <laughs> you see, I accidentally right click through the fucking tentacle after the minus four. Mm. Last action, investigate. Three up. All right. There we go. I don't know if I just, like, final destinationed us by denying that tentacle that was planning on coming out, but... We'll Is there see. a window before the Mythos phase to start paying the debts? I think there is. Let me check. 
I'm pretty sure there is. I think it's you have a, a ref, like a window at the beginning of refresh phase and the very end of refresh phase. Sean, do you recall? Oh, I don't know action windows that well. Okay. I, I can pull it up though. Let me grab no, my rules reference. Oh, I'm I'm already on it. Just so you know. Fair enough. Um, but if you have it physically, that might be faster. Maybe. Um, that's in my cabinet. I'm pulling it up digitally. That means you're probably going to get there first, so I'm going to stop. The last player window is in the upkeep. But is it before or after I draw a card? Is the... Here's a hashtag rules segment. Oh, it's before. Okay. So I would do it... Um... New phase, upkeep phase, player window. It had to be in the mythos phase, which is the end of the mythos phase. Okay, so I'll just say I did um, essentially this turn. So I can't pay anything this round on it. Okay. Yeah. Seems fair. All right. My turn. Um, goodness, do you want me to come heal you or something? Like, I I don't have things I can do. Uh, we have enough to advance. Do we? Yeah. Well, I feel like that might be a good thing to do. Right? Doesn't that, does that bring Neath into play or is, does the agenda? I think they both do. Um. So, it brings Neath into play. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, I got nothing else to do. So. Oh, wait, it's gonna add a strength to the abyss, so I don't think we want to do it yet. Oh right, right. Doesn't like fucking everything add a strength to the abyss in this goddamn scenario? Yeah. So Not what can we reduce here? We can go down to eight, or if we have eight or more cards in your hand. There's back at you. You know what? I don't think the act does, though. I think definitely the agenda does. I think the act just brings Neath out. Oh, it doesn't. You're right. So... So let's just advance. Okay. So I'll spend my four. I'll spend my two. And... We'll flip this over. Place two damage on each Cairo location. I'll... Okay, you got that. Uh, until the end of the scenario, they represent dreamers. Put the set aside neath enemy into play in the streets of Cairo. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going to unsnap her. Back. Snap. Snap. All right. There's a dreamer at your location. Test willpower or intellect. Okay, this is you. To attempt to awaken a dreamer, X is the strength of the abyss. If you succeed, move a dreamer from your location to Neath as damage. She has no remaining health. Let's take a look at Neath. She's important. She has brotherhood, so these guys are going to hunt to her. Uh, she's a 4-10-4 four, with Retaliate. Uh, forced after Horror from Neath's attack defeats an Investigator ally they are taken by the Abyss. Uh, when Neath is dealt any amount of damage from an attack, there's at least... And there's at least one Dreamer at her location. Remove one Dreamer. So, yeah. She can protect herself. Yep. Oh, uh, we need... Copy. There we go. Now we have all the Cairo things. Beauty. Right, so that was uh, not even my first action. Is that correct? Correct, yep, that was just okay. advancing. 
Uh, I should probably test slumber. Could be a good idea. Holy wow. crap! The streak goes on. Um, how screwed are you gonna be? No, you can you can move up to the city next turn, right? Because the hunters, one's gonna go here, one's gonna go here. You can boop boop up. That's the idea. Okay. Assuming I don't draw an enemy in Mythos. Hmm. So do I say near you Which, or? Which honestly, though, I don't think there's a single enemy that spawns directly on me, except for the little, the little gremlins. And what do you have? The creature. I have nothing. Like. Hmm. I have inquiring mind if I can get to a location with a clue. Okay. So why don't we at least an attack of opportunity to do Why don't that. we hope for the best? I'll go here. Sure. Oh no, then we can't plan for the worst. So. No, the abyssal is gonna come at me if I do that. So is Neath. I think I need to stay here actually. Sure. Yeah, it's both ends at the end at the dunes. Yeah. Um God, I don't even have an action to do. We at two abyss. Yep. Hmm. Do I come down and plan to do the this thing? Which thing? Uh, the one on sorry, the sunset runes. Do you have eight cards in your hand? No, but I can move, draw, draw. Oh, sure. You might get lucky and discard your weakness. <laughs> Well, a couple of them. Yeah, Unspeakable Oath I can't, because uh, Hidden is... cannot be discarded, so... Oh, like even randomly? Correct, yeah. Wow, that's fucked. Yeah. Um, but that gets rid of Slumber and Dark Sacrifice, so I'll move down. No, actually, first action, I will draw. Second action, I'll move seven. God, uh, third action, I gain a resource. Sure, I guess that's the right thing to do. All right, that's me. Okay, so Hunter. Puntus. Um so we can Yeah, so they do that. These guys, we can choose the order of hunting. But when the enemy phase ends. No, we can't. So Neath moves here and no, Hummel... wait, he doesn't move because he has clues on his location. Hummel supplicant moves here. He stays put. Okay. So Neath has an entourage. God, I should have put in dynamite, shouldn't I have? Yeah, Probably. well. Yeah, well. Uh, refresh. A Thompson. We are oh, at... Hey. Oh, we oh, advanced hey. on the ground. Oh, hey, I drew my open gate. Oh, no, wait, no. Oh, you did. Good. Uh, we advance the agenda. <laughs> which, no, gonna hurt. shuffle the encounter deck and add one to the abyss. So, I will do the shuffle thing. Okay. And let's go over the abyss, because I think we all have things that happen. Yeah, Slumber gonna, it's going to deal me a damage and a horror. So okay. I'll just take that straight on, because I have no other reason no yeah. other way. No other recourse, rather. Okay. And I just have this. Yeah, Slumber doesn't do anything. Well, Slumber's been doing something. Yeah. Uh, so, Garden of Shadows, if the Strength of the Abyss hits 0, 1, uh, set it to 2, then draw a card, heal a horror. And so... If we don't end the scenario before this advances, 
uh, we get fucked. Yep. So we need to resign or do something or whatever. Which, maybe we just resign, I'm not sure, but... Maybe. So I can open gate us. And then you can move in and, like, hit... I mean, I have... Supplicants. I have I'm out of here. So... Yeah, something like that. Okay, one sec. Let's just, uh... Uh, do you mind, do you have lots of money? Do you mind putting two on hospital debts? I mean, when you say lots of money. You have six. I'm, well, yes, I have six. I'm wait, also waiting for my, uh, uh, mob enforcer to hop out, but yeah, that's fine. Okay, so here's the thing. Do we want to just end this right now and go to expedition camp? Because I, I don't think we're going to defeat Neath. You don't think so? Well, there's it's two. There's two humble supplicants on our location. Yeah. So if I open gate here, mm -hmm. you can move, move, kill one, and then extra kill another. Action, kill another. Yeah. I can move in after you and start working away at Neath, and that's already heard down to, you know, less health. Okay, let's see what happens in the encounter phase. And can you pay money or no? Do you want to save it? Um, have we drawn encounter cards yet? We haven't. So let's, you let's you were at happens. six, right? Okay. Yep. Uh, you know what? Let's just make sure this was shuffled. I'm not sure if it was or not. Fair enough. For those people. Supplicants are aloof. Nope, they're not. Because the temple courtyard doesn't have any clues on it. Very good. Thank you. Hmm. Seems good. So I'm not doing the action here. I mean, I don't think so. If I lose it. I have to discard a card anyways. Okay, so Steadfast for some 5 to 3. Okay. Uh, so discard a card so from hand. Three cards from your hand. Is it Choose? Yep. Vicious Blow. Do you think so? Even with us up against Neath? Okay, well, I can't discard this. <laughs> I can't discard this. Okay. Soothing Melody? Three charges on your blade. I'd say Soothing Melody. Say your prayers, honestly. You got a lot of horrors. That's true. And then, what are the chances that you're actually going to play it on your Thompson? I mean, I don't, hmm. I don't think they're like crazy high. Probably low, but higher than on the lamb. Sure. Okay. Okay. Thing in the sarcophagus, which is going to hop in here. All right. Do we remove clues from expedition locations at any point? Nope. All right. Well, great. Then that's... Bye. Oh, I've never used that strategy to... before. Just leave yeah. clues somewhere. Mm -hmm. Seems good. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, you know what? Uh, we forgot a connector. This is right here. Yep. All right. Okay. Um, so fast action. Play a gate. Um, so, so you're at six, yeah. Okay. <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Bless you. Bless you a third time. <coughs> there we go. Thank you. <coughs> yep. All right. So gate uh, mm -hmm. hops down here. Yeah, sure. I'll pay two resources. Thank you. I appreciate it. 
I think I should be handle it. I I think I should be able to handle it from here. I think, but we'll sure. see. All right, your turn. Uh, oh, right. Gate is play only during my turn. Uh. Uh. Why? Well, I mean, I can come over there and and shoot things at four up. Yeah. On you, so. All right, so first action. Oh, uh, first action, then I'll play a, an ancient stone. Be back in like twenty. No, I'll stay here. One sec. Okay. Three more. Just text me, please. You're good. If you need to, if you need to go, that's fine. No, we're ordering my son's birthday present. Card from my Ooh. wallet. All right, uh, so first action there. Second action, I'll get a resource. And then third action, I'll just be ready next turn. No, wait. Right. Not resource. First action, play. And then move, move. Play, move to expedition camp. Oh! Do I just... Maybe I just do a, a dreamer here at the expedition camp. Yeah. Call so move, move, fight, fight. So it's play, move, dreamer, and I'd be three up. Yeah. Okay. One sec. Let me just get a, a picture of things here. Sure. So, dreamers. The way they work. Test willpower or intellect X. And then we move that damage onto Neath. And you are, we are. And the moving Neith. of damage supersedes the supplicant saying she can't be damaged, right? Because you're just literally moving tokens. Correct. That... Okay. Yeah. Yep. All right. So then three up. Start in on it at least. What have I done? What? Have you? I, I you can have that if you want. Right I here. mean, <laughs> all right. So three up, minus two. Right. So, so Neath has a damage from the location. Um, talk with chat. I'll be here back in like forty seconds. Sure. Oh shit! That revenant is gonna get me. And that's for three. Oh! That's, that's the thing. I was going to take that back then. Thank you, chat. There's a reason I didn't want to end there. All right. So, well, hopefully Scott's okay with this. Taking them all. Ugh. Literally everything is on. So that's fun. Um, okay. So you know, taking odds on what you think, what you think the odds are on us actually beating this thing right now. Ah, uh, I'll tell you what, guys. If past Sean knew what now Sean knows, this Daisy deck would be different. It makes me sad that I committed to this janky deck like in its beta phase and now I have to play through the entire campaign with it. There are there are things that are wrong with it. But so is Arkham, I guess. Alright. Um Yeah, I guess I can start doing a little bit of damage here. If you could do some damage that'd be great. Um um, no, so so in order to not get wrecked face by the Revenant, I did have to move in from my last act. No damage. Okay. Okay. So they're just they're just all on me. So any anything you can do to help me there would be sure can. So I will first action move through open gate. Second action move to your location. Nice. Third action. Uh, I am going to shoot at the humble supplicant who is not a monster. God. Darn. Neither is Neath. That sucks. Uh, so three, four, five, six. 
when you're empowering your blade? I am. Okay. Seven, eight. Uh... No, I'll use Vicious Blow on this one. Okay. Because I'll be five up with Vicious Blow okay. with the blade, not or empowered or whatever. Oh, boy. Oh! <laughs> so... Damage. You take one damage. Oh, if this skill test is successful. Uh -huh. okay, so cool, I take one. Still going to die unless... Uh... Unless one of those supplicants eats it. Okay, so I will pay two to get an extra thingy. And I'll do a blade charge. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh. Well, that's fine. Because you're what? still only on action two. You forgot slumber. Oh, no, I'm not on action two. Because I moved. Moved. Move, move, attack. So you would have already had to... All right, well. Okay, well, this attack move. succeeds. Slumber... Here we go. No, oh, no, hang on. No, slumber passed. Okay. I, I'm I'm drawing them as I, sure. as I'm calling them. So. Sure. The attack and slumber, pass. So one of them is dead. All right. Well, there's that. Uh, if you could beat cop the other one, I can finish it off in refresh. Okay, um, I will do such. Such as it is, so also as it is unto you. God bless. Or, praise be, praise be. Um, Hunter. Oh boy. So this guy moves in. I won. Uh, and Oof, that's this it. This is getting tight. Sure is. Okay. Refresh. So I take, uh, well, enemy phase, I take a damage and horror. Refresh. Cool. I draw a card, get a resource, and when I draw a card, I'll spend a secret off of the ancient stone to finish off our humble supplicant here. Oh, so humble. Supplicant. Oh, so small. Right, uh, we're at one doom of whatever, five, I think. Yep. And did we have to shuffle the deck? I don't think we did. I don't think so. Oh, wait. Uh, when? No, we killed them all. Never mind. Mm -hmm. We're good. Okay, that's fine. Uh, that, that is absolutely fine, yeah. Nice. One down. Take two horror. I will take two horror. Okay. Okay. A dark sacrifice. Oh, I really surge. hope. Well, I mean. Surge. Oh, that surges? Yep. Oh. Okay, that's fine. Farthest desert. So oh my god, down here. We're going to be long dead before this guy becomes an issue. Yeah. Here, either right? either this end. desert? Yeah. That's not desert. This is... Okay. I mean, this guy's coming in. Yep. So... Yep. So, I'm going to shortcut my way away from him. Right? Or, do you, wait, do you want to go first? Well, can you hmm. take the damage if he swings in at you? Nath? Neath? I don't know. Oh, you mean... Oh, I see. So yeah, here's the I'm thing. To figure out I have a... Here. I have a... Um, what do you call it? You... Or I'm out of here. So why don't okay. I engage him and fight him? Neath? Yeah. Definitely a her. Her. Look at that bosom. And Look also the throat. the throat. Yeah. Look at the throat. <laughs> um. Oh, Etienne. Can you? 
Etienne, I miss him. I miss Etienne a lot. He's a listener, and I've like offered to play games with him before, but he never hits me back. It's sad. So you can't evade for sure. Like I'm kind of wondering if I just. I. A two four. There's no damage on Neath so far. Correct. Ugh. So if I put up my 45. So I put up my gun. Engage. And pew pew. Like, I, I think I just start, start shooting. And you help me as best you can. And worst case, Ontario. Um... Mm -hmm. Well, the Abyssal guy's down there. Oh my god, Sean, what do we do? Do you think we can kill Neath? All right. here's, here's what or I think. Or do we just resign? Because that, that's the other option, take, right? Here's what I think. You can take yeah. a lot of damage. You a lot of damage. You get as much damage on Neath as you can. Right. And then I supplement as best I can. And we see where we're at. Because if the Revenant comes in, you can handle that hit. Yes. So let's start there. Just don't miss. So you want me to just start shooting? But if I miss, well, you're I go first. But if you're if if I miss, you're dead. But that's okay mm -hmm. because I'm out of because we just can't let the agenda advance. Okay. I mean, I'd prefer not to take a physical trauma, but I guess I could. I'll live if I do. Right. Does he have or does she have retaliate? She does. Sure does. Oh wait, if Daisy, if if she defeats me and I'm taken by the abyss, can I play Daisy next scenario? No. Woo! Oh, that might solve my problem with the fact that I'm not satisfied with my deck. So here's an option. What if you shortcut down? Because you have shortcut, right? I do. And you just resign. Or no, we're on the resigned location. Mm hmm Do we just want out? What if you just resign? I mean, I suppose. Like, I wasn't really looking for either of the rewards from this one. Okay. Fast action. Pay off my hospital debts. Resign. Then I can just go ham on her. I think. But I don't think I can actually kill her. Okay, well, here, here's another option. Okay. I can play out my lab assistant doing two damage to her with my stones. Mm -hmm. I take an attack of opportunity, but that's yes. fine because my St. Hubert's key would heal me. Yes. I could draw another card doing another damage to her. I could three damage on her before I resign. I like that. That workable? Mm hmm. Yeah. As long as you fast action pay me. Oh no. Uh, if, if I play my lab assistant, that that's not happening. What are you doing with your four resources? Playing my 45 automatic, probably. But. Why? Well. You can take the horror. You have so much sanity. You don't, like, you don't have to worry about retaliate. Yeah, okay. Do your thing. Right? Wor worst case scenario, I, I'm out of here. All right, well, we'll see. All right, so I'll take an attack of opportunity. Play down my lab assistant. Draws me two cards. Yeah, of course you'd fucking. Um, so I'll pay. Wait, two. wait, wait, wait. Will you survive if you take him? Well, now I have to resign. But either way, I got two damage. On. Uh no, you can take it on your lab lab assistant. Oh, that's true. Actually, lab assistant takes all the attacks. Mm -hmm. Or do the attacks happen simultaneously? I don't think they do. I'm not sure. Either way, they can. Uh, they don't happen simultaneously, but they both happen before. Oh well. No, I don't think they happen simultaneously. Well, either way, I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. So two damage on Neath. 
You draw a card. Second action, draw a card. Do uh, third damage beneath. Which actually, the first two are deflected by the ones on the, the health and the location. Oh, this, the dreamers? Uh, yeah. Well, just uh, worst case scenario, sorry. I resign. So you're down to one damage you did. Okay. All right, then last action, I resign. Okay. Mob enforcer's me only, so he'll just hang out. And then Neath hops over to you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I'm just going to pay for the hospital debts. Because yeah. that needs to happen. Yep. Uh, slumber? I have not done slumber yet. So I will do this. Uh, equal. Wow. <laughs> you haven't missed the slumber test this game. It's amazing. How is that possible? Right, so Neath, I'm attacking for four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine to four, three, five up. Cool. That is two damage. Uh, same thing. Cool. Yeah. No, I still pass. I'm oh, five. you're five up. I'm five up, yeah. Was that two damage? Yeah, I, I did it already. So we're at five. Nice. Um. If I do... Let's see. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Pay for an action now. Could very possibly kill her. Uh, and he hits for three. Yeah, I think I'm just going to pay for an extra action, just to punch. Okay. So three, four, five, six, seven, with the charge, three up. I'll commit my Thompson. Okay. No, I'm not going to do that yet. I'll do three up. Okay. Uh, okay. No, four up. Because retaliate okay. is a thing. Okay. Nice. So she's at six. Okay, uh, enemy phase. Guy moving on in. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna move the hospital that's over here. So, Neath does for what, two. For what it matters, the other revenant goes to the Nile River. Great. Two horror on Lita from Neath. And Abyssal, X damage, which does that two, me to here. All right, Ra, fresh. Ooh, Ugh. <sighs> tasty. Uh, two of that many. Peril, peril. Victory. Yep. <laughs> it's a victory point, man. I've got an out. Yep. Okay. Um, so that adds... Slumber. One to the thing, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. That's one to the abyss. So we're going to test slumber. Okay. Okay, so slumber finally hits. Okay. She finally gets sleepy. Okay, let me just let me just think this through. You have two actions to take. Yep. Think seven eight. The punch that's nine. Be caught for ten. Yeah. 
So three, four, five, six, seven, eight. She retaliates and just take it. So I need to take, okay, so I have two, two actions. Mm hmm. So basically, you need to hit the first one with Vicious Blow, and if you miss it, then you probably... Or I take the, vis the first one with no... Vi like, so, I have a 4-up and a 2-up. Or I have 2-3-ups. Yep. ups And I think it's literally 6 dozen of the one, half dozen of the other, because if you miss the first one, yeah. then... So, yeah, you probably do the first one without the bonus, with the lower bonus, because at least yeah. the second one, then you're more guaranteed to hit it. Yeah, okay. Or so closer I, to guaranteed. I'm tacking Neath uh, with no weapon or anything. This is three, four, five, six, seven. Is that right? Three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Three up. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Would you just turn to seven? Okay. Okay, so now vicious blow. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's happening. And now I beat cop, beat cop for the final damage. Whew. Holy shit. My heart can't take this campaign, Scott. Oh. Okay, so we advance. We'll keel over before the end of it. So now we need to destroy Neath once for all. Or spare Neath and listen to what she has to say. R1 or R2. Yep. Oh my goodness. I, like, I need a fucking cigarette after that. <laughs> oh. That was... That was well frickin' earned. Um, how do you do pages on this instant thing? Um, I can like just shuffle till I get the right page. That's an option. So okay, do we want? So nothing do was taken. Do you want John and Jesse Burke? Do you want Team Rocket? Well, I don't that... particularly want him. Nor do I care much about the Yonk. <sighs> Okay, let's one second. I'll get the the two cards and we'll take a look. Right below. Right, you're not looking at. I am looking at. All right, chat, help us out. I think. I think I want John and Jesse Burke. I mean, they're not bad. Think about the onk. What's in my? What's in my accessory? Lot. I don't think you have anything in, in the accessory slot. I don't think I do. I think I want John Jesse Burke. And just, like, it's free damage. And honestly, like, it, it, it's... So exhaust them, deal one damage to them, which whatever, they have tons. Choose an enemy at a connecting location, move that enemy's location. So basically, like, when you're away from me, I can just yeah. show up and... Thing. So I think I take John Jesse Burke. Sure, that seems fine. Yeah. Okay, so we go. We destroy Neath. Yeah. R1. Destroy Neath. Oh God, we start at four strength of the abyss in the next scenario. I forgot <gasps> that carries over. Oh, that hurts. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Fine, I guess. So, each investigator earns experience <sighs> equal to the victory X value of each card in the victory play. Oh yeah, we should see um, how much victory points I get minus two. Three, four. Four? Wait, is Neath victory? Yeah, Neath is victory. So five. Yeah. So I get three XP I can spend. Nice. Which actually might just be a charisma. Am I crazy? <laughs> I mean, you do have a lot of allies. I do. 
think especially, especially with the Burks might be worth your while to like upgrade your flashlights to lock picks, but maybe that's correct. You just stay in my hand for a really long time. I guess that I mean I only have one flashlight. So Sure. That's a discussion for another time. Um yep. So just switch on over to this. Resolution. Uh, so, uh, if you are not a regular listener to Mythos Busters, and I'm not sure why you're watching this, if you are, question mark, but hey, good on you. Um, Sean, do you still want to do your bracket? Tomorrow? I'm down. I'm, yeah. I'm going to need another beer, but that's fine. That's a-okay. So we have this contest going on. Um, it's the, it's like March Madness, but it's March 2 Madness, and it is a bracket uh, for Arkham Horror Investigators. The way it's working is there is a bracket set up. We'll provide the links and such. Um, basically, you make a bracket like March Madness where you're trying to figure out what which investigators are going to win and such like that. Um, each round, as far as who's going to win, is going to be left up to public vote. So uh, it's not based on like solo or two player or multiplayer or who you think is the most popular or whatever it's just i guess technically popular vote community but gut feel yeah community gut feel um and so if you want to enter that go to mythosbusters.com slash march to madness i think it is um mm -hmm. tomorrow is the last day you can put in which is thursday april 16th uh, this is the 15th we're doing this on, so Sean and I are going to do our bracket. Um, but yeah. Uh, and are, did you still want to do that with whoever wants to stick around for it? Yes, absolutely. Uh, free to enter, and you can win prizes. Uh, yeah, if you guys are listening live and you haven't done it yet, do it. Uh, what do we get? Stick R1? Stick with us, because... We're gonna yeah. So we got our one, but we'll we'll stick around and actually start a new stream and probably post that video because you know why not? Probably yeah. Three XP for skids. So stick around and draft with us, cause what the hell else are you gonna do during quarantine? Woo! Exactly. Okay, see you in five minutes. Bye.